So as you can see the snow is falling and we're going to walk to our neighbours because today is our neighbour Slava. For those that don't know, um, in the Serbian Orthodox tradition, and I think it's unique to the Serbian Orthodox tradition, every family celebrates Slava, which means that they have a patron saint. That's what we were saying in England anyway. A patron saint for each family, and on that day they celebrate it. They have like a feast day when people are invited, um, yeah, to go along and have lunch, which traditionally is a massive affair. Lots of food and drink and, uh, yeah, good company. So, we're not walking through the garden because of the snow and all the mud. So, we're walking up the road. And I don't know how much I'll be able to show you because it is a family thing and not everybody wants to have a camera going but I'll try and do as much as I can and let's see how it pans out this is strong coffee So that was my neighbour's Slava. On the 20th of January, every year his family celebrates St John because St John is the patron saint of his family. Tons of food, uh, a really good atmosphere. Uh, when I say tons of food, I mean a mountain of food. It's all homemade. There's nothing that was on that table that came out of a packet. Um, yeah, okay, the drinks, the Coca-Cola and the beer and any wine. Obviously, that wasn't done at home. The rakia was made at home, definitely. So that's what uh, Orthodox Christians, Serbian Orthodox Christians do. And as I say, I'm pretty sure that the Slava is unique to the Serbian Orthodox faith, which is up here in the north of Bosnia and Herzegovina. It's part of my cultural journey. I've been used to it for the last 20 years. And as we go through the year, you'll see how different people in different areas of BIH do things and how we do things here in the village that is now my home. I hope you liked the video and thanks a lot for watching.